Welcome back to Cool Clubs Reviews. We're here with Mark. Let's talk about Ping i525. Yeah, this, is, this has been out for a little while. Uh, we're just catching up on some of these videos, but uh, this is kind of right between the two. We just, uh, the videos on the i230 that just came out and the G430 just came out. You know, it's, it's a pretty traditional looking shape. Um, I did actually play around with a set of these for a while and I, and I kind of like them. Um, pretty clean look on the back, um, you know, but the shape overall and the top line is pretty thin. It really does look pretty good from the top. Um, I think it goes back to like some of that. This look, to me, is a bit more like the old school ping look. Yeah, it's a little square looking, especially yeah. when you look at the wedge. It kind of bugged me a bit, actually, in the wedge. You know, it worked great you know, and had no problem bending it weak like I like to bug my wedges. But uh, it was definitely square toe. Yeah, you know? seems a little a little like slimmer on the bottom, sharper in the heel, sharper on the toe, like pointing up there. Um, and then more importantly than that, is what does it do on, yeah, on the robot? Yeah. It's, it's kind of like, like I said, it's kind of that better player that wants some distance. You know, it's not uh, big and bulky by any means, um, and, and pretty hot. It's, it's got a lot of distance. So uh, we looked at the uh, I-230, went about uh, 148 yards, and this is going 160. So yeah. it's 10 yards longer. It's quite a bit difference that way. And it sits right in the middle of, like, Ping's iron loft range right now. You've got 30 and a half in, in the 7 iron here. Right. Um, and like you say, it's a distance iron. Like we just we kind of chatted shortly before this, and it sits in a very specific category. Yeah. This is a good player who finds the center a lot, but needs distance. Yeah. yeah. Um, the bad player who's missing it, you're going to see a lot of distance drop off, and I think you're going to kind of be maybe disappointed with seeing the, the right. drop so far down from the green there. But look how straight it is. It's one of the straightest. It does ones go out straight. There. Yeah. I mean, your miss hits, you know, basically right in line with you know, your target. So that's, that's a big bonus, right? So typically there's a you know walkway up to the green or whatever. So if you miss it short, you're in a better spot than. And left and right uh, for the most part so yeah you know it definitely is, is a good club and good engineer as, as ping does with everything um all around yeah i just think it gets a little lost between the two new ones now exactly so, right yeah. it's, it's kind of a weird niche it really is like we just said center, center striking uh good player who wants distance stopping power not world beating you know no. it's on that lower end there um and spin launch on that lower end so again just thinking about that when you're purchasing something like this it's a stronger more piercing ball flight right um as well Really, really hot off the center. That's, yeah, it is. It's it's long for a you know players type club. Yeah, especially yeah. that that loft. So yeah. great. But, uh, in, in mid range, you know, great yeah. club, but kind of a specific market. Right. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I like it. I like all the ping stuff, but uh, you know, this one's kind of right between the two, and it's, it's, I don't know who a player ends up with this one. Yeah. All right. I'll let him decide. Yeah. Right. <laughs> See ya.